Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another Dokkan battle video. So first things first, before we get into it, I do want to quickly apologize for the lack of content on the channel recently. Um, I've been dealing with some personal stuff that's taken up quite a bit of my time. It's nothing too bad, nothing to be concerned about, but that's the reason why there hasn't been as many videos on the channel this week, right? Uh, but with that said, we are back, at least for now, and today we are going to be showcasing a team that I've been having a ton of fun with recently since the release of the Int Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta. And that team is the Giant Ape Power team. Now, of course, when it comes to team building, you do have a few options, but this is the team that I've been using, and it is freaking awesome. So we got the double Super Saiyan 4 Gogetas as the leaders, LR Super Saiyan 4 Goku, LR Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta, Super Saiyan 4 Vegito, Super Saiyan 4 Broly, and finally, the uh, GT Super Saiyan 3 Goku as support. So that is the team we're gonna go with. Now without further ado, let's jump in here and uh, get this run started. Okay, so we have uh, not the best rotations. I mean, realistically, these guys all link pretty well with each other, but I wanna get the Super Saiyan 4 Vegito and the Super Saiyan 4 Broly together. And I also wanna get the Super Saiyan 3 Goku and one of the Gogetas together. So I think what we're gonna do is actually take the Vegito out of rotation. We'll leave the Goku there. And then I'm gonna wait for the third rotation where we get the uh, Super Saiyan 3 Goku and the Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta together. Or maybe I'll just change things up as we go along. Like I'm not really sure what I wanna do to be honest. Cause I also wanna get the Super Saiyan 4 LRs together. Yo, look at Goku, man. 12 key super. Over 3 million attack. That's, that's not bad. That's not bad. Like this team and like the release of Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta has really made me appreciate the LR Super Saiyan 4s a lot more. You know, like even though they're not the best Dokkan Fest LRs in the game, um, I forgot how hard they can actually hit, especially Super Saiyan 4 Goku. And then there's the counters and all that stuff. Like they're. They're pretty awesome. Okay, so on this turn, um, okay, so the friend one is the rainbow one. In case you guys missed it, mine only has one dupe, which is not bad, but the friend one is rainbowed and I think also max linked, or close enough. Okay, he's missing one level from over in a flash. So uh, this is almost as good as it gets for Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta. Uh, defense is at 164,000 on the first turn, which is also pretty insane. So why don't we, um, it's tough, because I want to keep Broly in the rotation to link with Super Saiyan 4 Vegito. So I guess I'll put him there. I mean, we're on the first fight, so I don't think it's going to matter too much if he gets hit before he supers, because obviously, if you guys don't know, his defense is really bad before he supers. So the concern is that he's, you know, going to take a lot of- Ooh, yeah, that's a lot of damage. <laughs> I was expecting him to take like 10k from a normal. Um, but it's fine, it's fine. Okay, so... Can we, actually, I'm hoping he doesn't- Damn, alright. I was going to say, I, I was hoping he doesn't kill the uh, Trunks so we can at least see Gogeta attack. But uh, it didn't quite work out that way, so... Um, it's cool. It's cool. Let's put the Super Saiyan 3 Goku there and let's see what my You know sad little 69% one dupe Gogeta can do defense is 133,000 still not too bad and uh, The main concern for this team is definitely the GT Goku or the Super Saiyan 3 GT Goku because as you can see 40,000 defense is not really gonna get you too far these days um, if we get supered in one of the later stages, he's gonna get us killed. So we're gonna have to be very careful with him. All right, there we go. 3.5 million for my one dupe Gogeta. So if this was the Rainbow Gogeta, if this was the Rainbow Gogeta with, oh, yo, are we not gonna counter? Ha, oh, this man. All right, whatever. Whatever. Doesn't doesn't counter the first super of the video. I mean, what did I expect? Yo, was that almost 5 million? 
Yeah, that was almost five mil. Pretty crazy, man. Pretty crazy. Okay, so I am going to leave Vegeta where he is. Let him show out a little bit, show off a little bit. And uh, Goku Black should be very much dead after the super. Yeah, about three million. Now, these guys are such beasts, man. That's why I feel like this team is so fun. Like, everybody just hits super, super hard. Um, especially Super Saiyan 4 Broly, actually. Even though his defense, you know, without supering is pretty bad. Um, he can do, I mean, with an extra support, you know, in addition to Vegito, he can do like 4.5 to 5 million per super. And then on top of that, he can super up to three times. And now we have the active skills. Um, okay, so what should we do here? Should I pop the active skill for Gogeta this early? Let's do it. Screw it. Okay, let's do it. So we're going to pop the active skill there. I'm going to save the Super Saiyan 4 Goku and Vegeta active skills for later on in the stage when we actually really need it. But there is Gogeta's active skill. His defense is 187,000. And can we get an 18 key super? I think this is perfect. Okay, yeah, we just got an 18 key super. And I'll give one orb or two orbs to Gogeta. And those for Goku. And let's see what happens. Alright, so yeah, Vegeta takes a while. Vegeta takes a while to actually build up. Um, obviously, he starts off more tanky than Goku, but his attack is, you know, gonna be a little bit low to start. Now, with the 18 key super, Vegeta does massively... Wow. Wow! <laughs> yeah, at first I was like, wow. Vegeta took a lot of damage. And then I was like, holy crap! But Gogeta, though... Gogeta though! <laughs> Yo. Oh my god, 4.9 and then 5.4 with the crit too. This is my 69% Gogeta, man. This is my 69% Gogeta. So imagine that was the rainbow Gogeta. I didn't even know whose Gogeta that is. Like at first I thought it was um Goresh's, but then I realized it wasn't even like it wasn't a guy on my friends list, right? So I don't know who it is. But I'm going to be having a lot of fun with that Gogeta in a second. Okay, so yeah, my Gogeta at 69%, 4.9 additional 5.4. Obviously, um, in terms of, you know, the hidden potential system, you do want to give your Super Saiyan 4 Gogetas as much additional as possible since he does have that high chance. Um, or, no, it's, it's guaranteed attacks effective against all types for the first 8 turns, right? And then it's high chance after. But uh, either way... You want to make sure he gets as many additionals as possible because um, if you just do the math, I, I didn't do it, but anybody that has done the math can tell you that for units with attacks effective against all types, they um, do more damage with more additionals than crits. Okay, so just just trust me, just do that and you'll be, you'll be good to go. That was crazy though. Oh my god, that was awesome. Over 10 million attack that turn, right? Like we generated over 10 million that turn. Man, the LR Super Saiyan 4s are taking a lot more damage than I was expecting, not gonna lie. I, I I thought they would, you know, still like get hit a little bit hard, but not to the levels that we just saw, man. 124 and then 70 something. But um, it'll be fine, it'll be okay. So we're on turn seven right now. So these guys still have their guaranteed uh, attacks effective. So I think, I'm going to save the active skill for Vegeta still, for when we're like a little bit more desperate. And these three combined should kill the Vegeta now. Look at that man, 11 damage with type disadvantage, 11. All right, so that's 2.1, normal additional, that's fine. And I would like to see some uh, super counters if we can. At some point, I mean, I know for the LR Super Saiyan 4s, it's not a high chance. It's like a 30% chance. But for Gogeta, I mean, it's 50%, I believe, right? 50 to 7. No, it's high chance. No, it's high chance. So it's 50%, which should should mean it happens half the time. So the first time we got supered, we didn't counter, which means that the next time we, we get supered, um, that, that counter should be happening, right? That, that counter should... Yeah, it should come through. So this is a tricky turn because we do have attacks on all three 
slots. And once again, man, this dude has 48,000 defense. I'm a little bit concerned. Um, let's actually you. I don't want to pop an item so early, though. I really don't. Okay, you know what? I'm going to risk it this turn. I think it's going to be okay. I mean, those could be my famous last words. <laughs> it could be, but we'll see what happens. I mean, if he supers Broly after he attacks, it's going to be okay. Um, the only concern is the GT Super Saiyan 4 or Super Saiyan 3 Goku. So please don't super me this turn. Oh, Broly, man. 4.4. Double super. One more. Give me one more. Damn. All right. Come on. Okay. So, I feel like we're going to get supered here. I'm terrified. Oh, God. Oh, we're still alive. Oh, we're still alive. Oh, okay. Okay, we're good. <laughs> that was scary, man. That was scary. Um, so, what should we do here? I don't, I don't really... I don't really know, because I kind of want to use my active skills and just kill him um, with the two Super Saiyan 4 LRs. But then I also want to heal up. I mean, should I save the Dokkan attack for next turn, maybe? We can save the Dokkan attack for next turn. Okay, yeah, let's spot the active skill for Goku first. That alone might be enough to actually kill Super Saiyan 4. Or no, who are we facing right now? That alone might be enough to kill... The Super Saiyan Blue Goku. Yeah, the Super Saiyan Blue Goku. Are you freaking kidding me? <laughs> what a waste, man. Okay, look, here's the thing. If I don't use the active skill here, then we're definitely going to have to use the token attack. And that's going to be even more of a waste. So I think we still should use the active skill here. Man, we've come a long way with these active skills. Right, these guys were the first active skills in the game, ever. But now, those animations, like, are light years ahead of these ones. I mean, they're still nice. I wouldn't say they're bad animations by any means. I'm just saying, like, it's a lot better now. <laughs> way, way better now. Okay, um, let me see. So I'm going to put Gogeta back here. But Gito should be okay, but we're still going to use... A Android 8 just so we can heal back to uh, mostly full obviously we do have the token attack which uh, oh I should have given that to Broly it's fine it's fine yeah um, token attack on the way and we'll be good we'll be good oh there's the counter from Vegito though not the Goku Vegeta or Gogeta Hey, you know what? I want to see at least one counter from every single unit on this. Or at least every single unit that can counter on this team. Before this video is over. Right? We have four of them. Only one of them has countered so far. So we need Gogeta to do his thing. We need Goku and Vegeta to do their thing as well. And uh, then I'll be happy. Alright, so that was not a lot of damage. But it also wasn't bad. I'm not going to complain about that. Yo, Broly, give me one more super. Come on. Alright. Alright. And these guys all hit so hard, though. Like, that's what I'm saying. This team is so much fun because everybody is doing this crazy damage. Did we just one turn? We just... We just one turn Trunks and Mai. We did, right? Yeah, I think we did. That's kind of wild. Okay, man, um, I'm actually terrified about that one attack in the middle here. Okay, in the middle, if that one attack is a super and I die to it, I'm going to be so pissed. I'm going to be so pissed, man, if that one attack is a super. Because I know that Vegeta can most likely survive. Okay, if he gets supered. I know that Gogeta can survive if he gets supered. In fact, he probably will counter that super attack. But if that one attack, man, on the GT Goku is a super, then I quit. Yo, this video is just, it's, it's just over. I just give up because clearly it's not meant to be. Yo, come on, can you? 
Bruh. <laughs> we took 12 damage. Okay. Okay, you know what? That's acceptable. That's acceptable. I was gonna complain really hard. I was gonna get really mad. Oh my god. We just took a normal for 123k. So, so... <laughs> it was like two different, um... What do you call it? Um, two displays of tanking ability, I guess, right? One guy took a super for 12 damage. The other guy took a normal attack for 123,000. <laughs> so, yeah, if you guys are doing stuff like this, I wouldn't necessarily actually recommend that you, um, you know, that you bring uh, the Super Saiyan 3 GT Goku. Like, I brought him just because uh, I, I wanted to have the support, right? I wanted some guys to, like, get more attacks that. There's the counter, thank you. I was expecting it. Um, but, yeah, he is just very, very dangerous to bring. So, I would definitely say bring a tankier unit, you know, bring, like, uh, the the Wrathful Broly or the Cumber maybe, right, the the uh, Fizz one would be good, um, there's a lot of options, right, like I just brought these guys because I love these characters, I love these units, and it makes the team more fun for me when I see like Gogeta busting out like 5 million attacks that or whatever, but the GT Goku man, the Super Saiyan 3 Goku, he's definitely not the greatest option here. All right, so are we on the final stage here? I think this might be the final stage, right? Wow, look at all those attacks. Look at all those attacks, wow. Um, well, we're definitely gonna pop this first. Right, we're gonna pop that for sure. And I don't think I have to be too concerned. I mean, we do have that GT Goku once again in the middle. So yeah, while I'm not concerned about the defense with type advantage for the Gogetas, I'm gonna pop this Princess Snake real quick. We're just, we're too far. You know, we've come too far to die at this point. So I'm just not gonna risk it. <laughs> and man, I'm so excited to see what this Rainbow Goku, basically with Max, I mean, oh, we're missing that one level for O and a Flash. That one level, it's unfortunate, but it is what it is. Um, but let's see what he can do, man. 5.7, yep, yep. Yo, if we get an additional, he might solo Vegito here, man. Oh, not quite. Okay. Damn, no additional. Mm. That sucks. That really sucks. Alright, it took 54k. If we didn't have the item, that would have easily been well over 100. I don't know what the actual number would have been, but I just didn't want to risk it. It wasn't worth it. Alright. Yep, yep, 57 taking very little damage, feeling pretty good right now. And let's see, I wanna save these STR orbs for Vegeta, but at the same time, I don't wanna put Vegeta in the front. His defense is at 114,000, which is not bad, but it does concern me. It does still concern me. So we're gonna leave our Vegeta up there. We're gonna give him these STR orbs. Broly will be fine. After oh nice okay so that's still a 24 key super for Vegeta right there, Broly will be fine after he gets at least one super if he gets two supers. Um, actually I don't think additional supers make a difference for his defense. But at the very least he does get his additional defense boost with the super attack, so he won't be you know a liability after that. All right so oh never mind there's a super on Vegito. We're gonna take. 199k, all right. <laughs> a little bit more than I thought. A little bit more than I thought. One more, one more, one more, damn. That's all, right, all good, it's all good. We're not getting a lot of additionals today. And I forgot this Vegito can actually dodge too. That's kind of annoying. Um, okay, so same thing. We are going to put the Super Saiyan 3 Goku in the middle. We're gonna do a Princess Snake. And I think this is gonna be the last turn. I'm calling it right now. If Vegito doesn't die, I'ma shave my head. And I've, <laughs> I just stopped promising that. <laughs> I just stopped saying that. <laughs> All right, here we go. This one attack I think should actually kill Vegito. No, okay, all right. That's fine. 
Oh, give me a counter. Yo, yo, super me right now. Super me right now. Please. We're gonna go this entire video without a single counter from Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta. Like, that's... It's not cool, man. That's not cool. And there's the additional from Goku. And Vegito is very likely dead. Very likely dead. Unless... Oh, no. Okay. Wow, I... That was unexpected. Okay, so we got one more chance here. Oh, and actually we don't. Screw it. You know what? I don't want to end this video on a normal attack. So we're going to let Super Saiyan 4 Vegito, who has been the clear MVP of this run, at least in terms of counters, we're going to let him have the honors and uh, finish this round. And this should be it, right? I think Vegito Blue is the final enemy here. Oh, never mind. I f oh, okay. We got one more round. We got one more round. Now, unfortunately, the Gogeta is int. So I'm very concerned about his defense here. I mean, it's high. It's 144,000. We did lose the additional 40% boost. Um, but it's still good. But nonetheless, this Trunks, if I remember correctly, hits pretty damn hard. Um, I'm gonna save the items though. I don't think it's really necessary right now. We'll see what happens. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Okay, so we're taking 6.9, 5.8. Not bad, actually. Not too bad. And if we do get supered, we still have the 50% chance to counter, which I'm really, really counting on right now. Oh, we didn't get the, uh, attacks effective. Didn't get that, so that's why the damage was so low. Um, ooh, yeah. Super Saiyan 3 Goku. Taking a lot. A lot of damage, even with the advantage. But hey, you know what, that's why the other guys are here. We'll be fine. It's gonna be okay. It's gonna be okay, guys. All right, so I'm uh, trying to get those AGL orbs for the Goku. Um, so we'll give these to Broly. That's gonna be a nice 24k super for a Goku. My 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 thought right now is whether or not an item is necessary. I don't think so. I don't think so. I think everybody on this rotation is gonna be fine. Uh, ooh, we're not countering. 272. I can live with. Yeah, I I can live with that. It's not awesome but I can live with it. <sighs> okay, about a million. There's the additional. As you guys can see, yeah, this team is not like the best overall team in the game by any means, right? But I would say it's the most fun team in the game right now. I mean, of course, that's just a personal opinion, right? Like I'm having the most fun with it out of any team in the game. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys have been experimenting with it. What are your thoughts about it? But this is a team that I've been looking forward to running for a very long time. And I'm just so glad, man, that us global players finally have a chance to use it. And there we go, guys. There we go. Giant 8 power. You know, a little bit of trouble here and there. A, a few scares in between. But overall, not having too much trouble clearing the uh, featured Trunk Saga stage of Infinite Dragon Ball history. Which, honestly, is still like somewhat of a challenge even though it's a little bit older it still can be pretty tough all right so yeah guys that is today's showcase that is the giant ape power category team on global definitely one of my favorite teams to run right now and uh thank you guys for watching hope you guys enjoyed it um like i said i have been you know dealing with some personal stuff off camera nothing too serious but it is going to take me some time to you know adjust and get back to my normal schedule hope you guys are okay with that and uh, that's all I gotta say. As always, if you guys liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you wanna stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it, I'm out of here. Until next time, hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.